rare news conference from the U.S. Attorney General this afternoon. We streamed it on the Fox 35 News app. He's defending the raid on former President Trump's Mar-a-Lago estate. Merrick Garland says that he did approve that search, and he wants the search warrant to be made public, but the former president has to approve that first. Fox 35's Lauren Blanchard has the latest from Washington, D.C. today. After days of speculation, Attorney General Merrick Garland spoke about the FBI raid at former President Donald Trump's home on Monday. Garland says he personally approved it. Upholding the rule of law means applying the law evenly, without fear or favor. The Justice Department has filed a motion to unseal the search warrant and the list of property taken from the former president's Mar-a-Lago home. Copies of both the warrant and the FBI property receipt were provided on the day of the search to the former president's counsel, who was on site during the search. The Trump team could, but has not released the information. The raid is believed to be connected to classified documents that were taken from the White House. Sources tell Fox the president's team complied with a subpoena to turn over sensitive documents this spring. But critics have been quick to say the raid is the DOJ being politically weaponized to derail a potential 2024 run. In a country like the United States of America, uh, people have constitutional protections, and if they want to trample over the Constitution, uh, we're going to be holding them accountable. The attorney general also said he did not make this decision lightly, but the AG did not say why they had to conduct a raid. It is standard practice to seek less intrusive means as an alternative to a search and to narrowly scope any search that is undertaken. The White House says they are staying out of the matter to give the DOJ independence. In Washington, Lauren Blanchard, Fox News.